Welcome to San Francisco, where the Golden Gate Bridge still stands as an enduring symbol of the power of commitment. At the time the Golden Gate Bridge was built, 1933, America was still very much at the height, the very height of the Great Depression. America had no reason really to invest in its future. And as it turns out, the Golden Gate Bridge back then captured public imagination. Now keep in mind, this was built without calculators, no computers. It's a 1.6 mile span across very turbulent water. And yet it was completed under budget by $1.6 million and ahead of schedule. You see, the Golden Gate Bridge shares a lot of commonalities when it comes to the power of commitment with something that happened 40 years ago this month when the U.S. Olympic hockey team surprised themselves and the entire world with the miracle on ice, Lake Placid, New York. That's right, they defeated a Soviet juggernaut. At the time, the Soviet Olympic team, uh, the USSR was regarded as the best hockey team in the world. In fact, the Russians at the time were beating NHL all-star teams. And yet, a group of U.S. collegians, led by the legendary Herb Brooks, went out there, pulled together where the whole was greater than the sum of its parts, and defeated the best hockey team in the world to win Olympic gold. Power of commitment was so illustrated. In fact, if you watch the movie Miracle where Kurt Russell does just such an outstanding job, you will see that scene where as a team, top to bottom on the roster, they all realized they had to play for the logo on the front of the jersey and not the name on the back. So right now you might be wondering, well, what does this have to do with my organization, my company, my career, the, the business that I'm involved with? That's why I think it helps to see a company like Charles Glenn Toyota, for example, also demonstrating the power of commitment. They're out there in Calgary, Alberta, June of 2019, they made a commitment to become Alberta's celebration destination. They looked at their culture, they figured out who they were beyond their products and services, and then backed it up by doing Facebook videos each and every day. They're always celebrating something. Today, I'm sure there's something else to celebrate. The point is this, for any leader today looking to create legacy, it will be impossible to establish legacy without commitment. I know we live in a world where things are moving so fast and people don't like to commit to this and then it's on to the next thing, but the Golden Gate Bridge, the miracle on ice from 1980, and the daily actions over at Charles Glenn Toyota are serving as reminders of what is possible when you actually commit to something bigger than yourself. That's exactly what this month is all about here on Leaders and Legends, where really the power of commitment can be the thing that takes you and your team to achieve whatever is golden in your particular world. As always, thanks for watching Leaders and Legends, where you never know who you're going to meet or what you'll discover.